I'm taking a picture of something, a big part of my experience, possibly the most weighty and significant thing I'm, that's happening to me is the narratives that I have about what's going on. So if I went back to the other picture and showed you a picture of that mountain, and I climbed that mountain and got pictures of the wildflowers, a big part of my experience is the narrative I have around things like wildflowers. The narrative I have around the effort of climbing a mountain. Do, do I think that is a ridiculous waste of time, or do I think it's rewarding? That's a story. That's a narrative. And we have narratives about everything. If you watch a commercial for Chevy trucks, or Ford trucks, or something like that, what do you see? You see like this guy in jeans, and he's working, and he's loading stuff up into the truck, and he's doing all this physical work, and probably the sun setting, in, in, you know, indicating this guy's working to the end of the day, and then his truck helps him get all this stuff hauled away and done, or whatever. Why does the advertiser paint that kind of picture? It's because they're appealing to a narrative. The narrative that they believe their target demographic embraces, that of the hardworking every man who sees a truck as a tool for getting things done and has kind of a, you know, a personal relationship with this four-wheel vehicle. We have, you'll see it everywhere in, in advertisement and in cinema and in everything you do, narratives are what control your experience. And when I say narratives, I, I want you to understand I'm not talking about a story that is defined and clean cut. Like once upon a time, I walked up onto a mountain and I saw a snake and the snake scared me. Um, that's not the kind of narrative I'm talking about. Narratives are how we give meaning to all the events that we, that we experience and see. It's a framework for giving meaning to everything. If we didn't have narratives, then everything would just be a series of events. So when we're talking about taking a picture and capturing our experience, being mindful of what's going on starts with being aware of our own narratives. The own reasons, our own reasons that we're impacted by this, this scene. I happen to think rattlesnakes are really cool. I've encountered them. But you have a different narrative around there, rattlesnakes. And I'm not saying your narrative is wrong. But if I'm trying to communicate that this is a cool creature that I think is amazing, and I'm basing that on my own narrative, that communication is going to land flat with you. And there, that's just the reality of the fact that we're different and we have different stories and different narratives. 